Hey, what's up guys? It is Ratmark here. So it's a little bit late, uh, but I am interested in seeing it. I have not seen the trailer yet. Um, I wasn't even aware about it until earlier this week. So I've uh, tried to not, yeah, definitely not watch it. Uh, so I'm going to watch it here with you guys today. Uh, see what I think uh, with the new Last of Us uh, going on HBO+. Plus. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at that. Voila. All right, here we go. The roses have like faded. It. There's frost at my door. All right, yeah, that's going to be copyright. I have to shut as quiet as, as quiet as it can. I absolutely love how the, so far they've captured the grittiness of it. You know, just, oh my gosh, that looks good. I love, I am so far loving the mood they have on this. Oh my gosh, the clickers. Like the impact, God. And Pedro Pascal, oh my gosh. So we're going to see it. So. Did so we'll see. So, yeah, Neil Druckmann. Good. Yeah, like human against human, like at the end of it, and then like people going mad. Oh my gosh! Like, wow. Yeah, so far that is. Yeah, I think this looks really, really great. To be honest, and I'll be entirely honest. Like, my biggest draw to this is gonna be Pedro Pascal. Like, for reals, he. Everything I've ever seen him in, uh, like he's always been an amazing actor, and I'm so excited. I wish we got to see a little bit more of Ellie. Um, but yeah, I loved uh, the, the, the video games. They were absolutely great. We'll see how it goes on... Uh, Yeah, how it goes on this, but uh, yeah, I am super, super excited. Like, and I love like the effects, like the backdrops, like the the ruined city. Um, let's uh, let's see if we can pull up some of these things real quick. Like. That looks really good. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> like, I am... I am so... All, like, I love how they've done with the backdrops. Like, even the grittiness. Like, you can tell... Like, with everything... Where is it? Like, just how mucked up everything is. So yeah, I we don't see much of Ellie. Uh what we do, it's there's some fairly shocking stuff. The clicker, oh my gosh, like that thing is horrifying. They're all trying to be quiet. Like I'm wondering how close to the video game they're actually going to get on this cuz this because it looks like they really, really did good. God, I love Pedro Pascal. I, d I just can't get enough of this guy. For reals. Uh, but yeah, people looking out for themselves. Neil Druckmann. He is... Yeah, he, you know, props. Props on him for actually making such a great video game. Yeah. 
so yeah, it's like, a lot of crazy, no, I can't really get a good shot, unfortunately. Yeah, they're all just firing. Yeah, like the, the absolute fall of society going on. People left behind, like who can you save? That that was a that was a phrase from the video game, I believe. It's been a while since I played the first one. The second one I haven't played, to be honest. I've seen let's plays of it. So I, I kind of know what happens, but yeah, I mean, so far it looks like they're being really, really awesome. Why? Yeah, just really... Like, I like how practical everything looks as well, how realistic. And I'm sure there's, there's CGI effects going on for sure, but I mean, this seems like very gritty, like very, they want to be authentic about it. So this actually makes me really excited for it. And I love how they're capturing like certain moments, certain backgrounds. I mean, look at that. Like this is legitimately like one of the, look at that blood everywhere. Like, oh my gosh. And that thing, like, I'm just like, wow. I cannot wait to see how these things look. Like, I don't know if it's CGI or if there's anything practical about it, but man, it it looks it looks pretty sweet. I mean, it is a brief little clip of it, but whoop! Don't want to do that. Yeah. So we'll see. Like, it looks good though. Like, that is pure and solid, like, so see it again. Yeah, like, that looked really good. And then the two of them together, I, I can't wait to see how this, like, actually looks as it's happening. And yeah, uh, we don't know the dates, but it comes out next year, 2023. Uh, I will be checking that out. Hopefully I'll be in a better position. I might be able to get HBO Plus, better job. Yeah, all that good stuff. So I'm not going to be like as financially tight as I have been, which has kind of constrained what I've been able to do lately, to be honest. Um, but yeah, this looks absolutely amazing. I look forward to reviewing it. And uh, I hope to see you guys there. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my sort of reaction to this trailer um and i will catch you guys next time see ya